Hello, hello. Welcome on Love Love AI. We are an amazing AI community of builders, innovators, and creators. And our goal is to help our members to build their AI apps during seven days hackathons. We offer tutorials, membership, and a platform to showcase their ideas to find potential investors. We are excited to have you joining us. And now, let's have a guide on the Lovely BI website. Use our journey from the beginning till the end. But remember, the Lovely BI journey will never stop. So, now we're on Lovely BI website. First of all, let's see our sections. So at Lovelo we have AI hackathons where you will see all the information about our upcoming events. After that, we have AI apps where all of them, all of apps built on the platform will show up so you can go and check and get inspired. After that, we have AI tech where you may find all the information about our uh, tech tutorials and tech pages. So you may check documentation, you may check access to the latest technologies on lovelove.ai. And also we have AI tutorials where developers from our community actually saw how to build with this tech. If you will scroll a little bit down on our platform, you will find a blog. There are a lot of articles, how to start your journey in the hackathon, how to found your startup, etc. So you may find a lot of useful info there. To participate in the hackathon, you first need to choose the one really interesting for you. And we have actually a variety of hackathons to choose from. So here you can see upcoming events where you can register. You click on one of them, for example, let's go to open a hackathon. And now you can see the page for the hackathon. Here you can go through all the information needed for the hackathon, about all the technologies we are going to use, about the challenge actually of the hackathon, and all the needed details for you to get more inspired, of course, because here also you can see application from previous hackathons. And super important thing is this one button, enroll now. So after you click this one, you need to put your email here, after you put your email, you will receive a code. After you copy the code, which you received on your email, you paste it here and click Submit. Now you are almost enrolled. You need to put your name. For example, my name is Lisa. Uh, I'm putting my name, username, Lisa. I don't know my profession. For example, student, years of experience, you can choose many. Yeah, you know. So we created our profile and now we are on the hackathon. So this means that you're actually in. And after you enroll, let's go back to sections. As you know on which hackathon you will participate, the section with AI tab will be very valuable for you. Because there you will find the documentation details and how to use, how to connect all the technologies we have on our platform. If, for example, you know that you're participating in Koyu Hackathon, it would be very good for you to find in this section information about Cohere Tech, how to use API, and which model may be the best fit for your idea. Also, we have AI Tutorials section, where you actually can find a lot of tutorials on the technology you will build with. You may use it to train before the hackathon, and also you may use it actually to build one of your ideas during the hackathon. Why not? If you didn't come up with your idea and you need some inspiration or you want to make a small competitor research, you may go to AI app section. There we have very nice filters when you can filter all the apps there by technology and also you may find it by name or by some specific area of expertise about this app. Go there to get inspired what other people build and also to check does the app you want to build already exist. And of course other blog. Here we'll put for you the most valuable articles if you just started and if you're new to AI, it's must read for you to be successful during the hackathon. And also there are a lot of ideas on apps you can create during the hackathon and just valuable information for you as a hackathon participant and community member. Check it out. So back to the hackathon page. Now we are back to open a hackathon page and at the place of enroll button, now we have create or join a team. So we press there, and now we have a guide, actually, how to get started, create a team, find or join a team, you have options, and this is what we will talk right now. So after you connected to Discord, you have two options. You can create your own team or join an existing one. And here you can see the list of existing teams who are looking or not looking for a team member, or you can create your own team. 
When you click this button, you can make a team name, write some description, and click the button. If you are looking for team members, if not, then you can add your friends there, and actually you can write what you're looking for, for who are you looking. So, for example, we are looking for a designer. And what is your time zone? We put this one, and then you can have a cover image. So now you go to create. Now you can go to create your team. Now you are on your team page. You can go to the Twitch page. So when the hackathon starts, you will have it here. You can click the button looking for team members. If you are looking for team members, you can allow users to ask you for help or turn it off. And you can click the button calling for help. So during the hackathon, when you have a problem and you need a mentor to help you with your problem, you need to press this button, then mentors will see that you need help and they will jump right into your team to solve the problem. Here you can see how many days to hackathon you have left. And here you can see team members. You can add a team member or team members will be added directly because they will see that you are looking for a team member. And you can invite a team member via URL here or invite directly from participants from Lovely VI Hackathon because here they mentioned that they are designers and as you remember we are looking for designers so we can invite this person to our team to work together with us. And now let's check team progress section. So here we have step-by-step -step guide what do you need to do during the hackathon. After you create the team, you need to invite team members or allow people to join your team as you will press looking for team member button. Then uh, you may create your channel on Discord if you have more than three people in your team. And then you may meet your teammates there and communicate with them directly. Also, you may choose whatever channel of communication you want that is more comfortable for you. Just make sure to notify all the teammates. After that, uh, you will have time to discuss your concept with your, with your team and then with mentors to choose the best idea to work on during the seven-day hackathon. After that, you will work in hard on building your prototype. And then the best time, it's last day or last two days of the hackathon where you need to start working on your presentation. After that, uh, you need to create your video, record the pitch, so judges can check it out. And now we will go to the final step, which is project submission. Let's go to the button, submit your project. Yep, so now we can submit our project as we already did it during the hackathon. Let's make it, it will be test. Okay, test one. And then make sure to write a very good and SEO-friendly summary so people can easily find it on Google as well. So let's describe our project, but now I will just pay the random, random words so it will allow me to move on, okay. And then uh, it will be the long description, so here you may describe uh, what exactly your project is about, so when judges will check your project, they can easily understand what's going on and um, does this project actually worth something. Let's go next. Here we have technology we used. It's very important to put them because on the app discovery page, as you remember from the beginning of the video, your project will show up during the specific tag. After that, you may paste your cover. Better to create if you have your own logo. Very good, you may paste it here. Then here you may upload your video, video file of your presentation and pitch. Make sure to put GitHub repo. By the way, you can make it public or you can make it private, but make sure to give access to the people that need to check it as our judges or mentors. So we need to make sure that you didn't start work on the project um, like way before the hackathon and that you didn't stole somebody else's project. So we have the list of emails you need to give access to. So make sure to contact our mentors and they will give you this list. After that uh, demo platform you used, we have a few options, which is Streamlit and Replit. You also may use other platform, whatever you prefer. And link for demo where we can actually go and play with the project. And after that, make sure to upload your presentation so we can easily go and check. And if you have some additional information to add, make sure to add it here. And you may submit your project. So after you submit your project, your application will be visible on AI apps apps discovery as we mentioned before 
And super important is that you will receive the certificate after submitting your project and after Hackathon will finish, you will receive the certificate on your email and also it will be visible on your profile on LabLabAI platform. So make sure you share that on LinkedIn because we have this option. So what's next? What is after the end of the Hackathon? It's a very good question, Lisa. As you already on Discord, you are the part of our community. Here we have a lot of channels for communication, for sharing your ideas and projects. Also, feel free to participate in other hackathons. Make sure to stay tuned in our channels and to sign up and follow all our social medias and we'll be happy to be in touch with you. And don't forget that you also have opportunity to be part of our mentor team, to join us as a speaker for the hackathon, write articles or tutorials on Lava today, blogs of everybody will be able to go and check it. Stay tuned and happy to have you in our community. All the important links you can find down below. Looking forward to see you during our upcoming AA hackathons. Bye bye.